G'day guys, this is Nick from stridewise.com. After 10 years of living in New York City, I am bringing you the best places to buy boots in New York City. We're currently right by Penn Station, and we're visiting the Manhattan headquarters of what may very well be America's most iconic and best known boot brand, Red Wing. I am here with Christian, the store manager of Red Wing Manhattan. Now, if, if someone is uh, looking around to try and find the best place to buy boots in New York City, why should they come to Red Wing? What's, in, what's special about Red Wing? Ooh, Red Wing shoes. We've been in business since 1905 as a producer of footwear. Uh, we have everything from outdoor wear to work wear to our obviously very fashionable uh, classic inspired heritage boots. Uh, we can definitely find you just about anything uh, for any most needs when it comes to footwear. So the thing with Red Wing is, it's a lot of guys' uh, first like good pair of boots, right? Yep. Like this this whole channel, uh, this whole came from the whole idea came from the first time I got a pair of boots when I moved to New York City and I needed wow. something to handle snow. I didn't before in the tropics of Australia, mm -hmm. and I was all over the internet and I landed on a pair of uh, Red Wing mock toe boots. And then my second pair of boots was the Red Wing Iron Ranger. Like it really is. It's like the, the, what's the word, the archetypal boot, right? It's like the boot, it's the platonic ideal of a boot yeah. is the Red Wing boot. You get the thick leather, you get, it's resolable, mm -hmm. uh, it's very water resistant, uh, it can handle basically anything you can throw at it, but it has like this really nice kind of classic design that is never gonna be uncool. Yeah, exactly, they've definitely uh, become timeless. Like I said, the Iron Ranger's been around for quite a long time. Mock Toe is one of our most iconic uh, styles. You, we see them all over the place. We've seen them in movies. Uh, the Iron Ranger is definitely one that's uh, been photographed quite a bit. Um, all purpose, works very well. It stands up to New York winters, but definitely stylish enough to really keep going through all walks of life, whether you're working in an office, whether you're working outside, a machine shop, or even someone who wants to kind of dress these up and be a bit more fashion forward. It's definitely something that uh, can stick around for a long time and really, really be an asset to a wardrobe, definitely. So when it comes to all of our heritage brand products, like I said, they're all made here in the US, right up in Red Wing, Minnesota, exactly where the uh, company is from. Like I said, we own our own tannery. Like I said, all of our quality products are using our best quality materials and construction and with hands that have been probably in the business for quite a long time. Yeah, so I have like a, a, just an obscene amount of boots in my life and uh, for an American-made pair of boots, uh, I've been with like leather from America, yeah. it, Red Wing really is very good value. The thing is, because Red Wing is, uh, is often a guy's first pair of boots, as it was for mine, mm -hmm. a lot of people kind of balk at the price of these boots, but actually, uh, if you, like if you've bought sneakers your whole life, then you're not accustomed to the normal price of like a resolvable pair of uh, boots that are gonna age really well. But actually, like, uh, like this boot right now is under 300 bucks, and like for that, Made in America, again, resolable, full grain leather, all this kind of stuff. Uh, it really is, it's a, it's a good deal. Uh, it's, it's fully American made and American owned. Um, and a few other ways that they stand out in the market is they also have a line of women's boots. Like these sorts of like uh, kind of chunky, I don't know, like masculine sort of boots. Like you often don't have options uh, from other boot companies that are for women as well. They do sometimes, but very rarely. Red Wing actually has boots that are a women's line that are made and designed for women as well. So they can have like some resolable boots as well that actually fit them because the fits are different for, for women's feet as a rule. Uh, in addition to that, Red Wing also has like a whole work line as well on the other, on the other wall over here. So in addition to the Red Wing Heritage line, which is sort of, uh, which is a bit more like fashion focused. Um, these are indeed like they're gonna work really well. You can be on your feet all day in these, no worries. Um, but if you are someone who has like a job that requires you to have like protection against like electrical yes. shock or they need to be waterproof, not water resistant, uh, heat resistant, that kind of stuff. Uh, Red Wing also has a line of boots for that as well. So it's, uh, it's just about everything you could want from a boot store. While the price point can be daunting for some people, when we have other brands that sell a product that's maybe 20% of our quality at probably an extra $500 than what we're spending just for a name brand on the side. Uh, the difference is that you're getting something that you can keep around for quite a long time and maybe even pass down. I, said, my, I hope my son at some point loves these boots as much as I do and here you go because I know that they'll definitely be able to stick around for that long. I really have owned and uh, reviewed and worn and have seen ridiculous amount of boots and Red Wing really is very legitimate, just really solid quality, solid value and like just classic cool kind of styles yeah. that are never gonna go out of fashion. So yeah. it's never gonna be bad to have a pair of Red Wings in your closet. We are on 32nd Street, is that right? 32nd Street between 6th and 7th Avenue, yes. Come on down to Red Wing Manhattan if you are in town and uh, they'll take care of you.